Hi, I'm Brandon Lee Sears. I am an American actor living in the UK, and I am currently playing Donkey in Shrek the Musical. And I am here to show you a day in the life. But not only that, I am going to be encouraging you and inspiring you uh, because that's what I love to do. It's what I was put on this earth to do. And especially if you're an aspiring musical theater performer, you want to join me. We're going to have a good time. Let's go. So right now I'm going downstairs for my first entrance on stage. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. Oh, oh, oh. Help a donkey out. So I've just finished my first scene, and first song, Don't Let Me Go. Now during Lord Farquaad and Gingy's scene, I cool off where I can. You see those fans there. I grab a drink of water, and then I get ready to go on stage for my next scene. See you in a minute. So this is our head of department, Lewis, and he is also from Milton Keynes. We from Milton Keynes, MK, representing in the house. And at this moment, he puts on my hat. This is the Holy Trinity right here. The Holy Trinity, carrying Sheila, dragon. <laughs> Just finished interval. I've had a little break. And now I'm going back on stage for the top of Act Two. I'm feeling rested, rejuvenated. I'm dry from sweating. Let's go. So this is part of uh, our team. This is uh, it's a collaborative process, obviously. So this is Alex who gets me ready every day. I love Alex. And also we bond over dogs, food. Um, Alex, is, Alex is quite unique because uh, Alex has also had a career in TV and film. So she always tells me, we always talk about TV and film and she tells me what she's worked on. I think that's really interesting. She's actually training Bella. <laughs> and uh, yeah, this is our team. This is our, this is part of wigs, hair, and makeup. We call them the Wham team. It's the flash on. There you go. <laughs> ready? We're ready. time at the theater is 1 p.m. on a double show day like today normally I wake up um, I always try and do what I call my savers which is silence affirmations visualization exercise reading and scribing that's just journaling so here's my little journal here I try to meditate and remind myself of my goals and dreams and stuff like that uh, sometimes I skip exercise since we're doing two shows anyways I'm gonna get enough exercise and obviously we always have to steam on a contract like this, when it's grueling, you need to have your trusty steamer so you can keep your voice in good health. My trusty, loyal roomie, Scotty, who plays uh, the wolf, Big Bad Wolf, and Papa Bear, or Papa Ogre, and Shrek. So we're about to leave and go to the theater, and I'll see you soon. Come on, we to warm up. I'm running late as usual. It's warm up time. It takes about 30 to 40 minutes to get into costume, hair, makeup for Donkey. And now I'm ready 
let's go. Okay, so this is Craig Stevenson. He's head of lighting and video. and video. And this is a little spotlight from, where does this come from? It's the Roby spot from the Advanced Trust, our third spot on the show. So this is our third spot on the show, and it follows me sometimes. And it follows from way up top. Isn't that cool? We're playing a game. Yep. You have to mouth the lyrics of a song, and you've got to guess. In the show. In Wait, the show. We've got to go on stage. <laughs> oh, do you lock? Yep. <laughs> Backstage can be a crazy place. So introducing the real heroes and stars of the show. Backstage crew in charge of keeping us on stage and safe. Ben Larkin, stage manager. Craig Stevenson, head of lightning video. Heather Fox, yeah, ASM book cover. Yeah. Georgie Ward, sound number three. I'm Dan and I'm the tech swing. I'm Kyle and I'm the tech ASM. James Wood, head of sound. Oh, hello. My favourite number to perform is probably Freak Flag, but if I got an opportunity to wear this, it would be forever. What's your favourite song, Jamie? I didn't see you. I have to say, make a move. Because it really, this wonderful brand of Lisa is, is captivates that stage and it gets my heart every time. Hey, there is never a dull day. What's it like being in Shrek the Musical? Um, um, it's a whole lot of glitter and makeup. What's it like being in Shrek the Musical? There is never a dull day here at Shrek the Musical. What's it like being in Shrek the Musical? Oh God, it's so fun. What's it like being in Shrek the Musical? Incredible. It's awesome! Hi, this is Jason. Jason the deer helps me in morning person. Goodbye! Does our production sing forever or donkey pot pie? So, as you can see, I'm right now in my witch costume, but I'm also the dragon, and we sing forever in this production. And she slays <laughs> when she sings it. This is obviously one of my favorites. Big Bad Wolf. Yes, yes. Oh, she's yes. lovely, this one. Show us the tail. Life's great as a wolf. <laughs> yeah. Hey, dragon, how do you feel, dragon? Happy Chinese New Year to you. Do a Chinese New Year dance. Do a Chinese New Year dance. Do that bop bop again. Do that bop bop. Yeah. Come on, lyrical competition. Come on, lyrics. <laughs> Yes. Ooh. Yes! Yes! That's good! Happy Chinese New Year, we had to wear rings. Things on delay for your- Congratulations on being cast in your first row. Oh my gosh! I am- I always write down all of my lines and the other characters' lines in the scene. Um, just as a technical way of remembering the lines, if I write them down, I remember. But also, if you understand emotionally and psychologically, like, what's going on in that scene, if you really understand why every character is saying what they're saying, and you understand that part of the story, then you'll remember your lines as well. I hope that helps. Okay, so I would make sure that you go in the room as the character. Don't give them any doubt that you are the person for the job. And also, don't be afraid to make choices, specific choices and big choices. We are all embodiments of real people. So you have to think of Donkey as a real being. And how does Donkey move, walk, think? Everything about Donkey has to be super clear and go in and smash it. Thank you, thank you. I was a foster kid and so I didn't always feel seen or feel accepted, but the first time that I performed a solo on stage, the validation from the applause, from the audience, being seen and feeling accepted um, from that performance, obviously, like it just stuck with me so much. And my core values are connection and community. That's when I feel good. Um, and theater has always been that for me. And so that's definitely why I got into theater because connection, community, um, and that feeling of belonging uh, has always 
felt like home. Thank you, thank you. I was a foster kid, and so I didn't always feel seen or feel accepted, but the first time that I performed a solo on stage, the validation from the applause, from the audience, being seen and feeling accepted um, from that performance, obviously like it just stuck with me so much and my core values are connection and community that's when i feel good um and theater has always been that for me and so that's definitely why i got into theater because connection community um and that feeling of belonging uh has always felt like it's for all ages go and fulfill your inner childhood this is the second time we've seen it and it's just incredible. It's so funny, we've just been laughing the whole time. <laughs> it's absolutely fantastic. It was just perfect for all ages and so much fun. They've been absolutely outstanding. So well put together. Everything was absolutely fantastic, it was brilliant. It's worth it, it's a family day out. I would totally recommend it, it's one of the best shows I've ever seen.